Okay, we're about, what, like 20 minutes, 15 minutes away? I'm glad that we've been in the U.S. for about 10 seconds, but I'm glad you're really retaining your identity. We're about... We're about... We're about... <laughs> Uh, yeah, maybe about 15 minutes. I haven't really let myself get that excited. I think because he was delayed a week um, for just some small medical issues. And so I was like so disappointed <laughs> and like super unnecessarily disappointed. Like everything was fine, but the week just seemed so long and so... We were like, we'll fly down, no problem. We'll drive 13 yeah. hours each way, no problem. Yeah, I think I'm gonna cry. I think I'm gonna be really <laughs> thrilled and yeah. just overwhelmed. So, how are you feeling? Uh, this is taking all of my willpower to not drive 300 kilometers an hour to see this little dude. I'm so excited. Uh, it doesn't even feel real yet. No, it doesn't. It's it like the wedding, really but actually. way better. Um, so his name is going to be Theodore, and he is a boxer cross. We're not sure what he's crossed with because he's a rescue. I just want to encourage you guys to check out rescue adoptions if you're thinking of adopting. Please adopt, don't shop, or at least look at a rescue, of any rescue societies around you before um, you move on to a breeder or something. There are so many unbelievable dogs who need homes, including so many puppies. Like if you want a puppy, there are tons, um, especially from the Southern states. And I think it's really important to at least look there first. I know that people can be a little bit afraid because they don't know where the dogs are coming from and they don't know if there's any behavior issues and I totally understand that that can be a concern. Um, but my sister and I both have or had rescue dogs. Roxy was a rescue dog and she was, no offense, the best thing that ever happened to oh, me. I just- not taken. She was just an actual angel. And my sister has a rescue dog named Sally who was, I think, quite neglected, a little bit abused, and she's definitely taken more work, but she is such an amazing dog, and I just can't express how important it is to me to at least look at some adoption agencies before moving on to breeders. You'd be really surprised what you can find, I think. And especially with puppies, if they're young, then you don't have any issues with behavior because you're going to be the ones who are you know exposing them to things and and training them etc so i will put all the information on this adoption society and any other articles that i think are relevant um, in my blog post so and there's also lots of dogs who are from breeders who have behavior issues and um that sort of thing so just just keep that in mind that's keep it all in mind. we'll see I'll see you soon. I don't even know what to say. Freaking man, I'm freaking out. This is Theodore. Hello, sweet boy. He's very chill. I think he's a little overwhelmed, probably a little tired. Yeah, he's a gentle boy. Yeah, he's, he's perfect. And I'm already crying. Yeah, you, well, you've been crying for 10 minutes and we got here 11 minutes ago. Hi. Get his perfect little nose. What's that, Theo? He's got a map. What's that, honey? What's that? We're gonna get in the car. Yeah. Theo's gonna ride with me. Yeah. He called shot. You ready? Mm-hmm. Hey, good little man. Did he pee? I don't think so. Okay, we'll stop in just a couple minutes. Ooh. You know what this cheat? No way. If you're not food motivated, you're gonna be a tricky little guy. You know what this cheat? You got me, little man. 
Oh my god, the waggy tail. Dio. This man is not camera shy. Hi. Hi. Just having a nap. Hey. Look at this little paintbrush tail. Look at these paws. Look at these paws. They're so cute. Okay, ears. Oh. Good boy. Good boy. You're smart. You're wicked smart. My guy's wicked smart. My guy's wicked smart. Go get it! Go get it! Go get it! <laughs> Good pounce! Good pounce! 